Next up, really quickly, is a movie that we have a whole review for that came out of South by. There's been a lot of comedies yeah. out there. Joyride by Adele Lim, starring uh, a slew of what I consider some of the funniest people out right now because mm-hmm. they've all been in different things. Sherry Cole is about to be in uh, one of my favorites. I, I think you also really liked it, Shortcomings. One, yeah. of, one of my most quotables out of uh, Sundance. Uh, obviously, you have an Academy Award nominee. Should have won in Stephanie Sue, who I keep forgetting. I, I'm, I'm, I'm wrapping up um, Mrs. Maisel. I keep forgetting yeah. she's in Mrs. Maisel. Mm-hmm. Like, this cast is in everything. Uh, so... And- but even more so than like they're in everything, it, it's one of those movies where it feels like this. They got all these people before they're not going to be able to afford to get all these people in a movie like this. Exactly, and hey, I think they play off each other extremely well. I think we're in that era of raunchy comedies where it's kind of difficult to review comedies because when things get so raunchy, like I made a no way, uh, no hard feelings video, mm-hmm. I liked it, but people either thought that I hated it. Or liked it, depending on what side they felt the move they were on for the movie. And it's like, ah, right. you're getting to this point where it's like, I don't know, policing jokes, ironically, by the people who want jokes to be as free as they can be, <laughs> makes no sense to me. Uh, mm-hmm. Don't be a, uh, you, you got me here, don't be the critic. The, don't be uh, Lights Camera Jackson when you're coming into <laughs> these already comedies, okay? They don't have to be for everybody. But yeah. when they hit, they hit. Let loose. That's the point of these comedies here. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, a lot of people are going to have, like, a lot of fun at this movie. There are a lot of, like, just ridiculous, in- insanely raunchy uh, moments in this film. For me, where it maybe, like, faltered a little bit is I didn't feel like the story had much cohesion or, or much flow. It kind of was just, like, sl- smash cutting from scene to scene to scene in a way that didn't necessarily yeah. let certain moments build to kind of, like, what felt like a proper climax. But that's, you know, some pacing issues aside, like, it still made me laugh out loud several times. And ultimately, that's the main reason to go to a comedy. So, you know, if you're looking for something raunchy, I think it's totally worthwhile to watch. You know, if not in theaters, then uh, definitely once it hits VOD.